Hello, my name is Steve Bailey. I'm here to do my picks for NFL Week 8. Sorry, this is a little late. Uh, first game is already underway, but I made my picks a while ago. I picked the Carolina Panthers to win this one 31 to 27. I think Tampa Bay is going to give them some trouble. Uh, watch out for the Buccaneers in this one. I think they might be able to get their first win. Everyone's picking Carolina, but I thought heavily about picking the Buccaneers for the last three days, so decided not to. Went for the Panthers instead. Next, Bills at Saints. I think the Saints win this 35-20. to The Bills have scored tw at least 20 points in every single game this year, but they're playing a Saints team coming off their bye with Drew, Be Drew Brees back there. I think the Saints are going to light up that Bills secondary. Next, Browns at Chiefs. A moderate offense in Kansas City struggles against the Cleveland defense, but I have the Chiefs winning by a score of 19-7. to I like the Chiefs' defense, especially against a team like Cleveland. Um, I don't expect Cleveland to score more than at least uh, more than 10 points. That's the highest amount they'll score against this team. Next, Cowboys at Lions. I pick the Lions to win this game, 34-28. to I like Detroit. They almost pulled off the win last week against a very good Bengals team. And Dallas, I think, is a little overrated. But, you know, they did play Denver tough. But as it seems, Denver does have a weakness. So, you know, I think Detroit at home is going to win. I don't think they're going to lose two straight home games. Next up, Niners at Jacksonville. It's not even in Jacksonville. It's in London, actually. Still, the 49ers are going to win 45-10. to 10. Jacksonville just sucks. And the 49ers are pretty good. So, Niners are going to take this one with ease. Dolphins at Patriots. Have the Patriots winning 27-17. to 17. Dolphins losing their fourth straight game. New England bounce, will bounce back after a loss. This is a team that does not lose two in a row. And I think they get the win against Miami. Next, Giants at Eagles. First upset pick, I'm going to go with the New York Giants, 30-23. to The Eagles' offense did absolutely nothing last week when I expected it to be a shootout, and they just couldn't do anything. So much for that Chip Kelly's offense being fast and high scoring. I mean, they do have some of the best offensive stats in the league, but when you're putting up three points like you did last week, it's not going to do much. I think the Giants get the win 30 to 23. Next game, Jets at Bengals. The Jets are riding high, but I think the Bengals knock that down. I think the Bengals win this game 30 to 16 relatively easily. I like the Jets defense, but coming off a win against the Patriots, I highly doubt they're going to get a win against another Super Bowl contender in the Bengals. Next, Steelers at Raiders. I'm picking the Raiders 28 to 24. They're coming off of a bye week. Maybe they got their offensive line problems fixed. Steelers are coming off a two-game winning streak, but I don't really have that much faith in them quite yet, especially considering they are traveling and they are playing in Oakland. Next game, Redskins at Broncos. I think Peyton Manning takes advantage of a horrible defense and wins this game 52-33. to Broncos don't have the best defense in the league, which is why the Redskins are able to put up that many points. But Peyton Manning will not lose two games in a row, not a, especially not in Denver. So I think the Broncos get the win. Next, Falcons at Cardinals. I think the Falcons take it 24-21. to 21. I think Arizona gives them a little bit of trouble. And I still think the Falcons come away with it, win their second straight game, climb back into that NFC race a little bit. The Sunday Nighter, we have to watch Packers at Vikings. And I think the Packers are going to win this game 27-10. to The Vikings quarterback situation is horrendous. And the Packers are hitting their stride. So I think Green Bay is going to get this win rather easily. And then the Monday night game, Seahawks at Rams. I think the Seahawks are going to win by a score of 30-6. to I don't have the Rams scoring a touchdown. The Rams quarterback situation is also horrendous, considering Sam Bradford just went down. So I think... The Rams are going to lose this game, and Seattle is going to win 30-6. to Those are my picks. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. And hope you guys are enjoying the Thursday night game right now. Thank you.